Hey guys, Prison Takir, and today we're going to be playing one of my old favorite childhood games SpongeBob's Battle of Bikini Bottom Rehydrated. Oh man, this, this really brings me back. I was debating on whether to do a no commentary or a commentary, but honestly, this is just one of those kind of games that I have to do commentary on. So let's just quickly hop in, not waste any time. Welcome Start. to Bikini Bottom, a normally peaceful undersea sanctuary. Today, it will be transformed into a theater of pure horror, wherein our little yellow friend will play the starring role. Today is the big day. I have devised an ingenious plan to finally steal the Krabby Patty formula. And if Bikini Bottom happens to get demolished in the process, oh well. <laughs> With my brand new Duplicatotron 3000, I'll clone an army of robots that will wreak mayhem and destruction at my command! One last review of the checklist. Let's see. Item number one is Plankton a Genius. Uh, sorry about that. Uh, yes, okay, checklist complete. Throw in the switch! <laughs> Welcome, my perfectly obedient robot army. Hang on, I want to get a photo for my scrap book. I hey, love the hello. fact that this all started because he forgot to flip doing? the switch. <laughs> uh, why would there even oh, be a no, switch like that no, there? What the no, hell? Wait, wait, but I'm your master. I made you. No, no, oh, my good China. <laughs> yeah. Another perfect day playing robots and racehorses. Yeah, only I keep getting the racehorses and the robots mixed up. Wouldn't it be great if we had real robots to play with, Patrick? I'd name mine Robo Jr. or Zorlon or maybe Frankie. Yeah, these unreal robots are getting boring. Hey, what if we put the robots in here? Oh, how shellfish of you. Actually. I think this is the only cutscene where it's, it's uh, different. Magic wishing shell. Wow, that's great, Patrick. Oh, the magic. Uh, the toy robots in isn't that the conch shell uh, reference? Okay. Then we say the magic wishing words and shake the magic wishing shell. Okay. Then we go to sleep, and in the morning we'll have real robots to play with. But Patrick. Aren't we going to say the magic wishing words? You already did! So, okay is the magic wishing word? It used to be Alakazama Alabala Wisna Tikitana Fushbar Griddle Bits Von Wiedeschnauzer, but I kept forgetting it. Are you sure this'll work? Sure! Last week, I only had one big cookie crumb, and I was really hungry. So I put my cookie crumb in the magic wishing shell, then I said the magic wishing word and shook it, and in the morning, I had lots of little cookie crumbs. Patrick, I proclaim that tomorrow is going to be the best day ever. Good night, Bob. <laughs> Good night, Patrick. Oh, uh, all these references, man. The all these references. <laughs> Gonna play with robots, gonna play with robots, gonna play with robots, gonna play with... Wow! Uh, Gary, did you do that? And we get into the gameplay. Yeah, Gary, it sure looks like we're in a doozy of a pickle. I think I'm gonna have to learn a lot in order to fix this mess. Meow. What a fantastic idea! These signs will provide important tips to help me out. Um, how do I read the signs? Oh my god, this is so colorful and beautiful. Look at that, man. I remember the first time I played Battle of Bikini Bottom, I was kind of complaining on how, uh, you know, it, it, it was, you're, you're playing in the SpongeBob's world and, like, all the colors really kind of, it, it just wasn't quite bright or beautiful. I, I wanted to play in this colorful world and now with all these redesigns, it's just, wow. Okay, press this button to read the signs. Okay, the right bumper. So if I want to come back and talk to you again, just walk up to you and press this button. I'd better get started now, Gary. I think that this is going to be a very long day.
Okay, now the only difference, I'm playing on an Xbox controller. <laughs> First time I did, it was, uh... So, right bumper to talk. Wow. Give me some credit. Okay. I make myself a snack. These are shiny objects. Shiny objects are very valuable and may be traded to help SpongeBob along his quest. SpongeBob will need to collect many shiny objects in order to complete his quest to defeat the robot minutes. There are five different colors of shiny objects. Red, yellow, green, blue, and purple. Red is the most common and the least valuable. Purple is the most rare and therefore the most valuable. More valuable shiny objects are usually harder to find or are in dangerous places. All right. Oh man, it feels so good. A note from Mr. Krabs. <sighs> and it even smells sweaty, just like him. Ahoy there, SpongeBob. As a faithful crew member of the Krusty Krab, you've been er uh, promoted to head shiny object collector. Wow! A promotion! That's right! A promotion! So what this here new job entails is you collecting all these shiny objects that the robots are leaving behind and bringing them to me. Now stop seahorsing around and get busy collecting. Oh, I went ahead. <laughs> I wonder, was that the original uh, Mr. Krabs voice actor? Because that's something different there. Uh, RT but oh right trigger I feel like okay. a new sponge. so that helps me check out uh, if my health's okay nice 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 bounce on the bed oh yeah double jump so it's been a while since I've played uh, change room Yeah, you don't need any explanation for this one. I keep all my old comic books. Oh man, look at the beautiful colors, buddy. Cat, take it. Actually, show me this. Press B in the air and we'll do a uh, bubble bunts. Oh, it's B. beauty of this world, man. Sometimes pushing a simple button is the most satisfying. Push, 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 push. There we go. Oh, there's a button there. My old comic books. No! Oh, I wish there was a grab feature. Okay, let's try that again. Still continues, really. Okay, I think we should have enough. Ah! 
this is a golden spatula. Well, I recollect it. Golden spatulas are needed to unlock new areas of the Bikini Bottom. SpongeBob will need to collect many golden spatulas in order to find and defeat the source of the rampaging robots. All right, let's head outside. I think we're good. There's nothing like the sounds of your own neighborhood. Oh my god, look at that Go color. Away, SpongeBob, you're polluting my thinking space. Trying to steal the Krabby Patty formula again, eh, Plankton? Well, you won't get away with it. I've got bigger fish to fry. I've got to figure out how to regain control of the chum bucket from those robots. Where did they come from? Where? Oh, uh, <laughs> I don't know. Not for me, though, that's for sure. The expressions, they just though. They out of nowhere and started calling me rude names and throwing things. They even bent all my spoons. I love those spoons like they were my children. That's <laughs> terrible. Oh, won't you help me stop them? Before they bend all my forks? Not the forks. Not the forks? <laughs> of course I'll help. But wait, I'm supposed to collect a whole lot of golden spatulas. Golden spatulas, eh? SpongeBob, if you can get me back into the chum bucket, I'll give you a bucket full of golden spatulas. In your dreams. You've got a deal. I love opening presents. Does it feel like I'm running pretty slow? Yeah, I remember you guys. Hey, SpongeBob! I bubble buddy! You see, you're going to need to learn some new bubble blowing moves if you're going to journey to the ninth dimension and defeat the giant monkey man! But, uh, all I need to do is figure out how to get rid of these robots. Oh, yeah, sorry. I've been in the soap bottle a little too long. Uh, where were we? Uh, something about new bubble moves? Right! Press this button and you'll launch yourself straight up in the air with bubble power that defeats anything that is directly above you! Okay. Hey, Patrick. Hey, Patrick. Nice sock. What sock? The one you're standing on. Oh, that one. It's lost. Well, if that one's lost, where are your other socks? Oh, they're more lost. A bunch of robots came through here and stole my whole sock collection. I could use some help getting them back. Sure thing, Patrick. What are best friends for? Is he holding something? Okay, then. For every ten socks you bring back to me, I'll give you a golden turkey baster. You mean spatula? Bless you. <laughs> Another find for Patrick. Ah, uh, Patrick, Patrick, you're just so lovable. Shines. I think one thing I always loved about this game was uh, after you were done. Uh, no, I was just saying, after you were done... After you were done, you could come back and technically reset these whole, uh, statues. So you can continuously, uh, farm for it. There we go. Second golden spatula. I wish they did a little bit more with the animation on the, uh, collecting the golden spatula. Looks somewhat a little bit dull, but it's still alright. I'm not gonna compl I don't even need it! Uh, I'm not sure if this is too bright, but let's continue on. I, I like how things are. SpongeBob, this flapping robot crisis is making the Krusty Krab lose money like a sinking ship. Yeah, no that is definitely no not crab. Mr. Krabs' voice actor. No more crusty crab means no more fry cooking. <laughs> no more fry cooking? But because you're gullible, I'm gonna help you out. And of course make a small profit in return. I've got a few golden spatulas that I'll be willing to trade to you for some of those shiny objects. Okay, wow, yeah, I, I don't know why I didn't get Mr. Voice, uh, Mr. Krab's voice actor, man. I would have loved a complete re-edit to the voices, but oh well. Let's move on to our first level.
Ah, the rolling green hills. Jellyfish fields. fields. A place to experience nature at its most raw. And sometimes a bit tender from the stings. Wow! <laughs> Uh, Squidward is just not having a good day. <laughs> Squidward, are you okay? No, I'm not okay. No, I'm not okay, you Oh, man. Do I look like I'm okay? Well, your nose does look pretty big. I mean, bigger than usual because it's usually pretty big. And you look clammy. And oh my gosh, you're, you're bald. bald. Oh, that expression. <laughs> That's from the movie! Oh my god! I've always been bald, but now I'm stung all over. Well, according to the Jellyfisher Field Manual, severe jellyfish stings can be treated effectively by applying a thick layer of King Jellyfish Jelly to the affected areas. <laughs> King j -j Jellyfish! Well, I guess you're off to scale Sport Mountain and die a horrible death under the vicious tentacles of King Jellyfish. <laughs> <laughs> you do that! Don't worry, Squidward! I'll bring back that King Jellyfish jelly for you to rub all over yourself! Oh yeah, King Jellyfish. Wish you need the guy who uh, stung Kevin when uh, Spongebob wanted to join the Jellyfish Club. I think I got that right. I, I swear, I, I can't believe how many references I've discovered so far, and it's only been like five minutes of gameplay. Jellyfish today, I'm going fishing for robots. I feel like a new sponge. There we go. Dun 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 Take that! Mm, mm, mm. Mm, 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 mm. I gotta try that one more. Mega combo. Oh man, the memories of this game, bro. The, the memories. This is just like the one game I'm okay playing every day. Just to, like after having a bad day. Just that. Just like okay with it, you know? Don't have to be too serious about it. Just enjoy gameplay. Shoot. Try to collect as many shiny objects. Oh. No. No. Our first death. Yeah, and that's the thing. I just stated. The reset. So you can endlessly farm shiny objects. All right, let's not waste too much time. All right, I think we're good. correctly I think you can get a sock from this side I don't know I got hit there but it's all good Fresh like a spring breeze hey, you Patrick needs to do laundry I don't think that's the right way. Yeah. I wonder, is there something... Show me options. 
gameplay settings. Maybe bring it. I ah, leave it like that. No, I thought I could increase the uh, the sensitivity of the camera. Seems like it is the way it is. Let's get one pair of underwear. Personally, I think they should have increased the uh, speed a little bit, but I don't know. I'm, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not even, I don't even know if he ran like this in the past. It's been way, way too long. Only Patrick, eh? Alright, I'll be right back for it. I can't wait to discover all the speedrun tactics used in this game. Or like, how are they going to continuously break it? <laughs> Uh Super Mega Combo Curious what that button does. On a purple one. Wait for that to go. <laughs> Our third golden spatula. Thought I saw something there. Actually, is there something I can work with? I was thinking more for like ability reasons. But they set it up so it's like. Ooh.
still alive? Oh, well, I guess he's, uh... You just met the Spongenator. The Spongenator. I love opening presents. Oh. Da da dun 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 da dun 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 Ah Oh you're gonna get revenge Oh come on How do I get there? It's really hard for me to get used to uh, timing my jumps. I'm using more of the uh, shadow to kind of tell me if I'm going to be landing there or not. I feel like a new sponge. Actually, no, no, no. Let's go back here. Well, I need to know the bubble move before in order to play this game. Ah. No, 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 no. Oh, shoot. That was close. Okay, looks like we have no other choice but to go up. Oh my god, the, the green uh, grass, the coral, and the water. Just beautiful aesthetics, man. I really hope when I'm recording this, it's not uh, too bright for you guys. Doubt there's anything else here. Oh, I missed the old uh, sucking, uh, sucking the box did. This is our Patrick level. Wow, Mermaid Man! I have all your comics and toys and mail. Huh? What? Oh, yeah, it's that Sponge Kid. And now, what was I supposed to tell you? That Patrick is surrounded by robots and needs my help. Uh huh? Oh, no. I think it had something to do with massaging my feet. Well, if massaging your feet will save Patrick, then massage I must. Help! 
They're making me hit myself. Dodging your feet isn't working. I think I better try a more direct approach. By clipping my toenails? Here I come, Patrick! By clipping my toenails? <laughs> I swear, I don't think that's the same voice actor. Oh man, I used to hate, um... No, no, I used to love this and hate it at the same time. There were just moments where you... That was a ton of like that! I should do it again sometime. You see, moments like that is what made me hate the uh, race. Oh no! How did I miss that? Boy, Patrick will be glad to have this back. You need to get Patrick to. Nice, nice. Well, of course, SpongeBob. Why wouldn't I be? Well, the robots and the... Oh, yeah, I found this for you. I don't know what it is, but it looks important. Thanks, Patrick. I tell you what, all that running around has left me pooped. Why don't you continue on for a bit? Okay. <laughs> okay. Oh, boy, oh, boy, oh, boy. Now, see, they kept the wacky animation for uh, Patrick, but SpongeBob, like, towards the end, he just blinks out. Press B to pick it up and throw the f press B against the throw. Oh, I missed the old uh. Ooh, wooden presents, so shiny. No, but I do miss the old uh. How do you say it? The old, there was a glove that used to point you in the direction. You sure gotta carry a lot of stuff around. Yeah, um, but it's, it's just a small thing. Not too bad. And I could have sworn you could jump with melon. Maybe I'm wrong. Then you do this. But that new, uh, that new jumping animation is something that I don't think I've seen that often. Or, might have been. Or I think they just used the uh, regular one. What? Really gotta be careful with that. to me. 
Almighty oh, Rock, I am at your command. Down here, you big pink lummox. Oh, hi there, Mr. Plankton. Are you going to vaporize me today? So very tempting. Unfortunately, I found myself in the undesirable position of having to assist you. I was in an undesirable position yesterday. And then <laughs> my neck hurts. Heed my words, my large future minion. Go into Jellyfish Cave. Follow the instructions on the signs that you see. At the end of the caves, you'll still be a big pink idiot, but you'll know enough to help defeat the robots and get me back into the chum bucket. Well, then will you vaporize me? I might spare your life so I can force you to work in my sweatshop, making low-quality design and knockoff wallets. Oh, thank you. This guy, man, this guy. Oh my god, this is beautiful. Oh, the lava. Brightness. Looks all so wonderful. Give me my watermelon. I'm just doing things uh, way too far ahead. Oh, uh, no, 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 no. Ow, ow, ow. Ouch. Oh. Yeah, ho. I don't think SpongeBob's underwear fits quite right. Wait, so you've been wearing SpongeBob's underwear? That's my I'm favorite. not too surprised, really. that just a tiki so bright so shiny yeah, I'm so surprised SpongeBob couldn't even grab that Oh, 
Of course. That's much better. Uh oh, this one goes boom. All right, the ice bomb. What does this say? Can dumb understand them? Small robots will simply be defeated by Patrick's belly fat. Larger robots will be stunned for a short time. Okay. Hey, my back feels better. Oh, again, again. I will crush them. That really does help out more. Ouch. Ow, ow, ow. I think SpongeBob's underwear fits quite right. Next to the machine. <laughs> Ahoy there! Squidward tells me you're looking for the king jellyfish. Yes. Good thing, too. That monster has been stinging all my good customers in their poop decks. I hear that you can find him up top of Old Sport Mountain here. Go hook that beast, sailor. Oh boy, Mr. Krabs. I'll see what I can do. This is not, I'm 100% sure that is not uh, Mr. Krabs' uh, voice actor. Just sounds so indifferent. Hey there, Mr. Robot. Ah, uh, gross. Tartar sauce. Love how they're adding a bit more of the citizens. That's much better. Gives the place a little bit more of a livelihood. SpongeBob's underwear fits quite right. Here you go, man. Mrs. Pop. Hello, Patrick. I've got a job for you to do. Oh, boy. I found a golden spatula, but those robots out on the island stole it and threw it into the lake. If you can figure out how to get it back, you're welcome to it. Show sure enough, Mrs. Puff. Okay. Okay. Actually, what was that? Push, uh... Oh, so it's the left trigger, so you don't need to hold it now. I will crush them. How many of these do I have to carry? It 
It says left trigger. I don't know what's going on. I guess it only works for Spongebob. Much better. This one to wear. Oh wait, I think I could I can pick up tiki's. Shoot, I just realized that. I don't think SpongeBob's underwear fits quite right. Much better. Ah, shoot. There we go. Wait, there's a whistle. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. How many does that make? Seven golden spatulas. You need ten. interaction is tell me you haven't been driving of course not mrs puff i don't even have a license oh good then it was just another bad dream <laughs> the uh driver's inspection oh shoot Uh, never mind, I found a better way. Alright, moving on. It shines. I love opening presents. Just met the Spongeinator. Yeah, those tartar sauce guys are really something I feel else. Like a new sponge. Oh shoot. Fresh like a spring breeze. Yeah, those are stones. I feel like a new sponge. Fresh like a spring breeze.
I'm gonna need Patrick for this area. warp me to. I thought you fell down. Oh, and that's where you can get... I wonder... I don't think I need Patrick, do I? Oh, what the heck, man? Finally, I thought I was gonna be stuck again. Good. Oh, sparkly. Hammer. I get it. SpongeBob Kent. Oh, wall jump. Okay. Spatula. Uh, duh. And here comes a boss fight. Bubble buddy. Step quietly there. That king jellyfish is just up at the top of this path. Good luck. You'll need it. Thanks, Bubble Buddy. Oh, 
that, 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 that. I knew the king jellyfish was big, but who knew he had such a beautiful voice? <laughs> Oh, oh, shoot, 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 shoot. There you go. Jellyfish gem. So you can just take a taxi. Oh, yeah. Oh. Oh, that feels so much better. Anything for my best friend Squidward. Can I rub some on? Uh, what if I just gave you this? And that makes a uh, nine. What the heck am I missing here? I'm assuming it's something I'd probably have to come back for. Oh well. Let's head back to town. I love opening presents. Okay, uh Ooh, I didn't mean to go there yet. <laughs> Downtown Bikini Bottom. Once a bustling metropolis. Now a debris covered crater. SpongeBob, the robots are destroying downtown Bikini Bottom. We have to evacuate! Alright, but it's gonna take a while to get all this dust. Not vacuum. Evacuate! We have to get everyone to safety. Can we just load them up in the boats? That won't do any good. Why not? Because the robots have taken all the steering wheels. Couldn't we just drive in a straight line? No, there are too many turns. Those fiends, they thought of everything. Never fear, Mrs. Puff, I'll get those steering wheels back. SpongeBob, if you're involved, I always fear. But I tell you what, if you can pull this off, I'll give you a golden spatula. Ah, I see an error right there. Right down at the bottom there. Somebody forgot to put a space. <laughs> oh, that's one cat clue there. Driver's license instead. Nice try. Okay, but you know what, guys? I think I'm gonna end the episode here. Uh, thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment. And I'll catch you guys next time. And that was a funny animation. Bye bye.